Alice, let me bring you in here. You, you're working with a lot of your you know, clients at, at Google. And um, what, what are some of the things that you're seeing? Yeah, thanks, Larry. And thanks, everybody, for, for all your insights. Um, so obviously, we are, we're really the infrastructure of a lot of what our, our customers are doing. So a big area that we're really focused on, sort of twofold, is really creating an exchange for data. So an environment where our customers have easy access or more access to data. So you can come and use our data sets for, across the exchanges, customer data, um, and a really kind of a, a diverse exchange environment for our data. And then obviously overlay that with auto machine learning, a lot of the you know AI that we offer um, to help with your analytics. So it kind of creates sort of a, a democratized environment for your data. So on both sides of it, we have the exchanges and venues who are customers, the large exchanges. Obviously we have a lot of uh, sell side and buy side customers. And this kind of creates an environment where all of these uh, participants can leverage and use multiple data sets. And this include retail data sets, geospatial, um, store buying, you know, everything. So it's, um, I think it's something that we're, we're really dedicated to and we're really evolving. And that's part of what, what we're trying to do here is, is create that um, sort of democratized environment for, for everyone to use. When, when you have all that information, let's just say in, a, in you know, some sort of Google store, uh, storage um, mechanism. I assume the the you know the, the golden ring is to be able to intersect those those data sets together and you know you know mix geospatial and all sorts of different market data together to try to you know interpret or understand it. You know how far are we are that are, are, are or are we there in terms of doing that? Yeah, that's a great question, Larry. I think a lot of our customers, um, certainly some of the, the big uh, buy-side firms are very interested in that. And they certainly saw uh, Google, uh, particularly in this analytics hub environment. So any of our customers that use BigQuery, which is sort of you know, the foundational um, data play, um, can, can actually provision and access that data. So a lot of the buy-side firms very early on saw the customer base that we had, the kind of data sets that were available and they've been doing those kind of um, overlay analyses for some time now where they're looking at geospatial, they're looking at retail, um, buying habits, um, you know, as well as some of the traditional data sets that you'd buy from some of the large exchanges. So it's become, you know, I think a very um, rich environment to, you know, kind of play around and then bring in the AI to kind of overlay, which everybody's been saying it's been in, on Wall Street for a long time, but I think some of these buy-side firms are, are really kind of perfect, perfecting that intersection.